Yo guys, what's going on? King Flipper here and welcome to another Player of the Month SBC. Today we are doing League Oons Player of the Month for December. Uh, Yusuf Yaziki. Uh, it's, it's not a striker card. I can definitely tell you that even though it's an 87 rate striker, it's definitely not a striker card. I'm definitely going to say now Cam Centre Forward. Very good looking card for a Cam Centre Forward but not a striker. Uh, 81 pace, 88 shot, 89 passing, 89 dribbling, 58 defence and 84 physicality. The reason for not being a striker he's not quick enough you'll see he's in games that's a uh, six foot one plus he's medium medium again that's not good for a striker uh, left footed four star four star which is good as well as you can see 77 acceleration is just not quick enough unfortunately for a striker 85 sprint speed is good but if you've got anything less than 80 pat like 80 acceleration or 80 sprint speed it's just you're just going to be slow <laughs> easy as slow the rest of the stats this is why i'm saying cam or center forward you'll see why 87 attack position and 84 finishing 96 shot power with 91 long shots hello 87 volleys which is good as well penalties don't care about uh, visions of 89 crossing of 89 free kick accuracy is not bad short passing of 91 with long passing 86 again you can see why i said cam center forward with curve of 95 okay agility 82 Balance 79, don't forget he is six foot one, so not amazing, but this shouldn't affect him too much. Reactions are low, 80. Mm, again, that's not great for a striker. Uh, ball control 91, dribbling 91, composure of 86, so again, a really good. Uh, head and accuracy of 84, inceptions is naff, the defense awareness is, is naff. Stand tackle and slide tackle, then over 50 isn't bad really for a striker. Um, jumping is absolutely awful. Uh, stamina of 90, really good. Strength of 84 and aggression of 84, again, really good. Uh, the good thing with this card is because it's from the league Oon, you can link him up with a few things. We got finesse shot, flare, long shot, take it out, side foot shot, technical dribbler. So, you know, he has some good stats as well. Two SBCs to do before we get into them, just to let you know, these are foot being by. Now, price of time doing this SBC, which has been out for about an hour, an hour and 15 minutes. Uh, bids and snipes will, of course, be cheap. And don't get, don't forget, prices do fluctuate. Uh, so, you see requirements of the top four. One, you do need one team of the week player. As you can see, I have Belander in there. Uh... He's the cheapest 82 rated team of the week card at the moment. You can throw in any 82 rated team of the week card with this one uh, because we're still above the chem uh, requirements. Uh, team overrun of 82, a smack bang in 82, can't lower anyone else. Team chemistry of 80, as I said, if you take the one off Belanda, then take two more off of my loyal players. We are on 81. No position change or loyalty, just of course strong links and 11 players in squad. So as you can see, we've gone Bundesliga because Bundesliga is nice and cheap because the right back and left back for 82 rates are actually cheaper because centre backs are still expensive and Ginter is still expensive which you'll see um castiles is the cheapest 83 rated uh, goalkeeper in the bundesliga at the moment at 2k bender is 2.3k which again is still cheaper than center backs uh ginter is again 2.7k so you can see why uh he's expensive Javi Martinez is only 1.4k. You can put a CDM in there. I've got Lamer up there as well. You can drop him in here as well, which actually, no, you can't because of the strong link. Hasselberg is only 1.6k. Again, really cheap for an 82 rated defender. Um, Balanda, as I said, is the cheapest 82 rated team of the week card at the moment at 12k, so you can throw in any team of the week card there. Uh, Campbell is 1.2k. Lamer is 1.2k, so that's pretty decent there. Lamer's actually really cheap considering he's an 82 rated card. Uh, Diaby, a little bit more expensive. He's 1.4k because obviously he's the cheapest high rated left mid if you get what i mean uh the rest the next left mid is obviously 83 rated and has you don't need that they're like 4k each uh, Cruz is 1k which is good in that center forward position and we finish off with Cranbridge, who's 1.1k beautiful uh 27.9k buy now prices don't spend more than 30k on the sbc you probably get it done for about 20 to 25 bids and snipes you get yourself a crap pack which is electron players pack both packs are crap just to let you know electron players pack uh, next one is the league un one uh requirements for this one you do need one league un player as you can see i got mandanda that goalkeeper he's the cheapest 83 rated goalkeeper in the uh in the French League at the moment and it's good as French which is sweet. Uh team over on of 83 with Smack Bug on 83, can't lower anyone else. Team chemistry is 70 if you take the two loyal players off around 71, no position changes or loyalty. Again, just strong links. Uh yeah, just strong links, no hyperlinks, and eleven players in squad. So as you can see, we've gone um Spanish La Liga, uh MLS, and then Mandana from the Ligue because MLS is cheap. Uh, Ator, we start off with Ator from the uh, Ligue, uh, La Liga, is 1.9k. Uh, Kappa is 1.2k. Uh, Palista is the cheapest 82 rated centre back, but you can use Dijon if you have him on tradable at uh, 1.9k. Uh, Jimenez is one of the cheap. He's actually one of the cheapest 84 rated cards. Anyhow, even though he's a centre back, which is even better, is 8.7k. Uh, Acuna is the cheapest left back at 3.7k. Uh, Mandanda is your league Oom player at 2k. 
Uh, Matuidi is 4K. He's actually one of the cheapest midfielders in the game at the moment. And he's from the MLS and he's French. So obviously Softlink's there, which is great. Uh, Rakitic is 1.5K, which is actually kind of cheap. Obviously, he's struggling to the Cunha Nails, which is a bonus. Uh, Vela, again, from the MLS is 2.4K. Higuain is 2.1K. And then we finish off with Carrasco, who's 1.6K. Uh, these prices may jump up a little bit because of the 84 player pick that's been released at the moment. But don't forget, these will come back down or they'll jump back up for team of the year. It depends on when you're watching this SBC. Uh, but it's at the moment, which since the SBC's just come out, it's coming up to 31K uh, by now prices. Again, 35K, don't spend any more than that. Uh, that's a that's a massive push. I wouldn't spend nowhere near that, in my opinion. Um, 25 to 30K, I reckon you could easily do it for bids and snipes. Again, you can easily put around different players in. You've got Robo, you've got Lamar. It's, it's just easy to mess around with. Um, you get yourself a another 10K pack, which is a mixed players pack. So, uh, at the moment, you can get this done for uh, 58.9k, so you're looking around 60k. It's not bad for 60k, but the, the, there's... Cheers, phone. Uh, it's not bad for 60k, but I think you can get better. I'd, let me know in the comments below what you think. Again, I, it's not a striker. It's a cam or a centre forward, but let me know in the comments below. He has some real good stats. If anyone's going to do it, then let people know in the comments below if he's any good. Uh, hopefully, I did save you some time and some money. If I did, guys, feel free to drop that thumbs up. Of course, it does help the channel and the video. Uh, obviously, if you're new and you want to see more SBC methods like this, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Make sure you got that notification bell on so you can keep up to date as soon as I upload these. But other than that, thank you very much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video stream. Take it easy, and obviously, peace.